there is a woman online, non-Muslim. She's still not a Muslim. Allah will bring her. Amen. She is a magician, according to her. What does she do? Black magic. And all sorts of casting of spells and so on for people. I want to tell you, it is prohibited as a believer to cast a spell. Man sahara faqad ashrak. The Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, says, whoever casts a spell has associated partners with Allah. They've engaged in the highest possible sin. That's it. You're not allowed to do that. Another thing, if you go to someone to do that for you, it's the same thing. By you going to them, you lost your faith. Remember, you have to repeat your shahada. Wallahi, it's not a joke. This lady was asked a question and the interview is online. It's on YouTube. You can go and search it. Is there ever people you try to cast a spell on and you can't? It's difficult. She said, yes, there is. Tell us about it. She says, the Muslims who pray five times a day. And this is a non-Muslim. What did she say? She said, the Muslims who are steadfast, it's as though they have a dome of protection around them. Wallahi, these are her words. When I heard it, I said, subhanAllah, I forwarded that message, that video to so many people. Here's a lady sitting in an interview telling the interviewer about how she casts spells. And it's a long interview, one and a half hours, I think. And inside, there's a five minutes where she speaks about this question. Is there ever a time when you can't really do this? You can't cast a spell? She said, yes, those who believe. Why? She said, you know what? The Muslims... They pray so many times a day, there's actually like a dome around them. She calls it the agrigo. The, the agrigo is very, very high. You can't really hit them. What happened? It's Ayatul Kursi, my brothers, my sisters. I believe in Allah. It's Ayatul Kursi. And it's the Mu'awwidat, the last few surahs of the Quran. Are we not taught to read it in the morning and the evening? The disbelievers are bearing witness. Where are we? May Allah protect all of us.